it's monkey 1000 and today i got a craft going on i bought from dollar tree a while back and um i decided to do it today so what we're gonna do i bought these cute little things here and they're they're cute i don't know if you can see it or not there you go might be a little dark i don't know why but here, let me see if I can turn this light on here. Uh, oop. There you go. So you can see that. And about three of them. And this one says, Hello Autumn for fall. I got them at Dollar Tree for a dollar each. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to string them together. So I got my string. And I'm going to put, Shaber is going to put a little holes in here and here on each one of them so I can put my string in and hook it and string it and tie it. And so we'll be.
Okay guys, we got the holes all done, as you can see, and there we go. Our lovely assistant, thank you Shea Bear. And now you can sort them the way you want. So I'm going to put the Hello Autumn on the top, and I'll put the green one in the middle, and that's how I want them, kind of like that. So then I'm going to take my string, and we are going to string it through. And I'm going to start, I think I'm going to start on the bottom so I can tie it up on the top. And then... We can hang it. I got um, I got an idea what I'm gonna do if I can get this strung through here. Uh, it take a little bit here. Try some tape, a little tape or something on the end that will string it through. That might be a good idea to do that. So let me get some. A little bit of tape here so I can start this and I'll be right back. Okay guys what we're doing is that we had to put some tape on the end of the twine so we can weave it through like a needle through the holes so it doesn't fray. So we're gonna do these. I got them upside down and we're gonna put them through here. We did the first box and you just kind of gotta take your time and Go through it if I can. And, and, no, it's not doing it. And just trying to keep it. We're helping. <laughs> there you go. And then we're just going to pull it through. And we're going to do this one here. And we're going to pull it through. And he's got the little things there. So from the drill, you can pull them off. I smooth it out a little bit. That might help a little bit too. And put it through the hole. Maybe. It does better than I do with it. I try to just play with it. You're better at it than I am. Just hold it very clear from the tip. Yeah. It's just barely a little bit hanging out. Once you get this on here, you can't twist it. Yeah, it would make it easier probably. Probably. Yeah. But you 
said, you want to go some olive oil? Well, I didn't want to go too big and then, you know. going to keep going and, and we're going to go up and around and then we're going to tie it on the bottom. So when we get to that point, I'll turn you back on. Okay guys, so now we are going to take these little doodads here. Uh, zip those tie. little ties. Zip the, ties. Zip ties. And your idea was, because if we don't, if we, if we just hang it, Right where it is right now, it's just going to bunch together. Yeah, these will slide yeah, down. Yeah, they'll slide so down. Take so, this on the inside there. Where? In the hole? No. Right around the, there you go, look okay. around the twine. Okay. Let's get it started up through there. Okay. Yep. And now squeeze. Get it, up, get it up against here uh -huh. and start pulling. Real tight? Yes, really tight. Okay. Oops. It's alright. It's sliding. It's okay. Pull it tight. So, that's as tight as it goes. Okay. And that'll keep that from falling down, see? It yeah. Stops. That is, if you can get this tight enough. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And then clip that end off. Okay. And they won't be seen. Oh, yeah, and they won't be seen. So we're going to do all it, every hole? Nope. You only have to do these ones. The top ones? Yeah, you don't have to worry about this one at all. Okay, so just do it here? Yep. One there, one there, and one there. Okay, that'll work. Because we were trying to figure it out. And Shea Bear came up with this idea. Anyways, just pull real tight. Make sure you get it where you want it. Yep. Okay. And we'll do one here. Make sure you straighten them out. Yeah. Okay, so you know. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Yeah. Trim your excess when you're done. Yeah. I think I got these backwards. Hard to do it on this side. There we go. These are handy dandy little things. Yep. We'll just pull it as tight as we can against there. Help. It's sliding on for some reason. Yeah. Okay. Hang on, hang on. This way, it'll help keep it in place when it's hanging on the wall. Or you can tie knots in every one of them. Yeah, you could do that. Or another thing, you could put little beads maybe up on the top here. Like little tiny beads. Colored ones if you wanted. That would hold it. 
place. Not on top it wouldn't. So there you go. We're lift it up. We're gonna lift it up and oh cool. And there you go. That's that. I like it. Very cool. Yeah. So now another thing I have an idea to do with this, okay? Because I like maybe to to just make it pretty up on the top. So I'm going to get a uh, fall flower and I'm going to put it on. Um... You have <laughs> your glasses have 275 on them. <laughs> Funny. Anyways, I'm going to put a flower here and hot glue gun it here. And where I'm going to put it, I'm going to show you. So Shaber's got the camera. So I'm going to put it probably here, up here, or over there, one or the other, by the clock. We have all this stuff in the house, so it's making things hard to, you know, move around. But I think it's cute. I think it'd look cute right here. And uh, you can see it coming in the door, and you can see it sitting down. So that's probably where I'm going to do it. So I'm going to get the flower. And I will be back once the hot glue gun gets going. I'm going to cut these off. Okay, guys, so we're back now. All right, I got the glue gun going here. I'm going to bring you up a little closer so you can see what I'm doing. I got a little flower here. And what I'm going to do is just glue it up here on the top. Hopefully it'll work. A little bit of glue gun glue on here. There's not much rope. If I had thought about it, I probably could have strung it through and put it on the top and had it on the string, but I didn't think about it at the time. Center it as much as you want. I'm going to put a little bit more on the other side so it'll stay. And there we go. And just let that dry. For a few minutes and you want to make sure it's centered pretty good i think it's okay where it is oops i moved it and we just push it down a little bit and let it dry i'm gonna let it dry for a minute and then i'm gonna show you where i hang it be right back okay guys so there you go i put the flower up on the top gave it a little decoration you can do whatever you want be creative and make it your own. Um, so that's it. It looks pretty good. I like it. It's cute and it's festive. So it only cost me one, two, three, maybe three, four, four dollars between four and five bucks. So not too bad. So, anyways, I hope you. Oops. Oh. It did something to me. <laughs> Cameras. Anyways, so I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's cute. It's been raining again all day today. So I've been ha I've had these. I bought them, you know, when we went to Dollar Tree. So I was like, well, I'm going to put them together. And, um, yeah, do a video on it. Why not? So anyways, Monkey says she's out for now. You can see all my junk behind me. That's all her selling stuff. And we can't sell because it's been raining. I wanted to sell this weekend. We weren't able to. So, anyways, I'm cleaning, doing a few things I have I've been trying to catch up on. So, and I did that. So, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed it. And stay tuned. I'll have many more coming up as seasons are coming. And I have more time now. So, um, Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all.